Hello YouTube, it is I, Pocket Gamer here, bringing you a brand new Let's Play of Sonic Generations for the Nintendo 3DS. Sonic Generations is basically the same game that was released for the PS3, Xbox, and PC. The only difference is different levels, different... There was different levels and uh, slightly different gameplay, but... Uh, besides that, it's going to be a 2D scrolling game, therefore, it's only left and right, so, um, yeah, Sonic Generations, let's get on to it. I've been wanting this game for a really long time, I recently bought it for about a month ago, and I wanted to buy this game because I don't own a PS3 or an Xbox, I do own, however, a PC. Let me lower the volume for this a little, because the music is great, it's just too loud. But anyways, Sonic Generations, one of my top favorite games, one of my top favorite character series. But besides that, let's get on. So yes. Just like the PS3 title, we start at the level straight off the bat. It's essentially, like I said, the same game. So, uh, Sonic Generations has special stages uh, for the 3DS version, but not the Xbox and PS3 version. Only the DS. Um, I don't know why. I wonder why. But if you collect 50 rings, you will not see the ending. But yeah, there we go, Green Hill, done in 30 seconds. This will be a really short playthrough, and I can tell you for sure because when I bought this game, I literally beat it in half an hour. First time I bought it, I bought it through um, Cartridge. This is the download version, thank you, the Lord, for downloads because huh, Sonic's confused. Sorry, give me a second. And Sonic sees something off in the background, and there's a void. But anyways, uh, I bought the downloaded version recent because I won't be able to trade it in. And I have a habit of if I buy games, I will trade them in. But anyways, Tails just here says, what? Hey there. Hey Tails, so what's up? You want to meet you here, right? Uh-oh, you're here here, Sonic. Of course I am. I am the fastest thing alive, remember? What is it? Is there a problem? Well, yeah. We're actually getting ready to throw you a surprise birthday party. Oh, yeah. oh, uh, uh, sorry about that. I mean, thanks for doing this, Tails. You're welcome. Of course, it would have been better if you came after everyone was here. I can do another lap around the planet and come back if you want. <laughs> um, no, it's okay. I mean, you already found out, so why don't you just sit and wait? Whoa, that looks good. Don't start yet, Sonic. You should wait until everyone gets here. I don't like waiting. Hey, this, this, this one with the ribbon is for me, right? Well, yeah. I wonder where you say everyone's taking so long. Whoa! Well, oh, Sonic, look out! And for some reason... Yeah, it's this thing. We don't know, like I said, I'm not gonna spoil it, but... Yeah. This thing is called, aka, the Time Eater. But besides that, let's just go on. What? Whoa, Whoa Sonic! Tails! Whoa, I'm getting sucked in! Hey, what's going on? Uh, help me, Sonic! And we wake up into this white limbo. When, which we don't know where it is. Where am I? Where's Tails? Hmm. What's that? Seems kind of familiar. Time to go take a look. And off we go. Yes. So just like in the previous title, <clears throat> Sonic wakes up here. He sees this place, and. What a better thing to do than to explore it. But anyways, Green Hill, Act 2. 
we have still got our boost mechanic, and thank you for not giving us the boost with some stupid method. It's thankfully it's a ring method again, just like in the Unleashed and the uh, Boss Starter game. I forgot. I'm sorry. <laughs> it was Unleashed and some other game. Uh, those two games gave uh, Sonic a boost with rings, and and this version you get rings as well. However, Sonic Colors did not have the ring boost. Um, but yeah, this is gonna be essentially a really, really quick playthrough. Like I said, you beat this game in why well, not say three hours, maybe two if you actually tried. I would just be lazy and just trying to get over with it in like a few seconds, and I forgot. Uh, we get later abilities like in the PS3 and Xbox version, but right now we're just basically. Uh, regular homing attacking Sonic and dashing Sonic and boom we just dodged that it if you actually actually if you don't boost through that you will die and since I don't have my full mechanics and my full um, move set I can't do it I can't do my other moves we get a later we get a stop mechanic and that helps me out a lot if I want to duck under really fast anyways Thanks, Sonic. I thought I was dead for sure. <laughs> Floating without a dark body in the black dark void. I'm gonna have nightmares for this for weeks. Well, I'm glad you're okay. Is it me, or did this place seem awfully familiar? Hmm, not really to me. But it looks something sucked all the life and color out of this place. Really strange, huh? Not. No stranger than rescuing genies from magic books or saving aliens in an interstellar amusement park. <laughs> Sonic Colors and uh, Sonic Colors and Sonic and the Secret Rings references right there. First things first, let's figure out what this place is. And they look around. Sonic. Hey Sonic, there's something over there in the distance. It looks dark. Maybe it's nighttime. And over there, a giant mushroom. That might be a good place to check out. I'll be back soon. And just like the PS3, Classic Sonic appears. Wow. wow, you weren't kidding when you said soon. I thought you were leaving. This is gonna be a 10 part, 10 minute part of videos because uh, something's up with my memory and I cannot save enough. So we are going to try to do act two of casino night hill in less than three minutes uh, but besides that or you know what no we are going on to the first special stage i'm going to be doing this then uh for the whole game i'm just gonna be uh doing one complete level and a complete emerald so it's gonna be uh i'd say about a 12 part of video so yeah uh, just like it, this is the Sonic Heroes layout for the special stage. So I'll send you all you gotta do is collect bubbles or balloons, whatever the heck these things are, and just keep on collecting. And yeah, basically this is just like the ring boost. It just fills up your boost meter, and the faster you do this, you can uh, get the emerald faster. This one's not too hard because, well. It's actually the easiest one because a there's no bombs that you have to dodge. All you gotta worry about is your dash filling out, um, not missing out. But I doubt it because there are balloons everywhere in this area. Um, yeah, Sonic Generation is gonna be a playthrough that I'm gonna be doing every two days. Well, not it's gonna be an everyday playthrough, but it's gonna be um, a short playthrough. I'll most certainly finish this much more faster than this Marbros 2. But besides that, we got a Chaos Emerald. And for every special stage, we also get a result screen. Since this was the easiest one, we obviously get the S ring. But besides that, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So, next time on Sonic Generations, we are going to be tackling the next stage. Uh, I don't have a problem with this stage, it's just... I feels pretty long. We are going to be tackling mystery stage. I'm just kidding. It's Casino Night Hill. It is I, the Pocket Gamer, signing out and saying goodbye.